All right, man, day three, let's do it. We got bench on deck, mostly upper body. Bench, probably some press work, some pulling work, some balanced, balanced upper body. Uh, how are you feeling today, man? After e good. eating all those meals? Uh, I'm pretty good. Pretty good? Yeah. Sorry, I'm tired right now. Tired? I woke up from a nap. <laughs> um, as far as eating wise, it's pretty good. Yeah? A little sore still, but uh, I think yeah. that'll go away once we start getting more into the room. Feel like? Yeah. Feel like it's more feasible? Yeah. Yeah, I guess I was telling you earlier, it's like, the food thing, before I felt like it was, it's not that it was unfeasible to, or not feasible to do, I think it was just not, I didn't have that motivation, so like, having yeah. you know, next to me, it's like, kind of like, man, Samir's doing it, man, I gotta do it. <laughs> Let's do it. Yeah. So it definitely does help when, like, it's like, next, uh, having you next to me do it with me. Mm -hmm. Having somebody do it with me. Uh, see how that plays a role. Get a, get a team, get a squad. Yeah. We should, we should come up with a name for our squad. Right now, we're too deep. <laughs> you and me, that's it. Too what? We're two, two people deep in our squad. <laughs> that's all we have. We have a whole squad. <laughs> we need to get a squad. Call it. The young and the restless. The <laughs> young and the restless squad. Isn't, isn't that like a... It's a show. It's a, yeah, it's not so popular. My mom used to watch that show. <laughs> Alright, let's get into it. Let's rock. Once you hit the bottom and you're about to press, push your feet into the ground hard. And like, almost try to like get your glutes involved. Like, squeeze your butt a little bit. And then come up. Okay. Ready? Three, two. Break that bar. Flex. Break that bar, control it. Good. About like three seconds. One, two, three, up. One, two, good. All right, you got it, easy. In the middle of the workout right now. Feeling pretty good, it's my second time doing bench today. <laughs> It's all good. Uh, did some gymnastics earlier. Now I'm about to hit a three, three station circuit, landmine presses right there per person, single arm rows, and then some Y rows for that mid trap area. And one thing, you know, one thing that Young and I were talking about a second ago is like, when you do a movement right, and you really perform and execute it like to the full degree that it could be executed, changes everything. It makes you use, use muscles that you haven't used before and it's uncomfortable because it's like, oh, I don't want to like expose that weakness. But once you expose that shit and you overcome it and you make that weakness your strongest link, <laughs> changes the game. Like you can feel that on bench, right? And once yeah. you pinned your blades down, it became different. Yeah, because I don't think I've ever had to pin my shoulders back while yeah. benching. Yeah. So I was just trying to lay down and and just press it. That's how you yeah. learn in football too, right? Just yeah. like press it as hard as you can. Yeah, it was just like get on there and go. Yeah. Okay. All right, that's it. Yeah. You know, but I didn't like doing it that way with like yeah, all, like, it's like right here only. Yeah. Like, you're isolating. Me. Totally. That, that's a different thing for me. Yeah, for sure. It's like doing it just like by blowing out your shoulders is a surefire way to like blow out your shoulders. <laughs> Like you won't have any like anything left in your shoulder joint if you keep doing it that way. Um, just because like you use so much of a delicate like shoulder is so delicate, right? It's like has the rotator cuff muscles, all these little fibers. And the more and more you abuse it, the more and more it just starts to degrade, and then you have to get surgery, which sucks. I think most people like most of like your weekend warriors get shoulder surgery because they bench wrong. <laughs> I was addicted to benching with a wide left like, elbow. Yeah. See, like, uh, those cues that I, I guess when we were doing, uh, I, I've never heard those cues before. It's like, yeah. you put it down here, yeah. when you're testing right here, yeah. that's all, that's, in my mind, that's what's been drilled into me, just going like this, you know, and it's just getting way up here. I've never known. It was so like, you go lower. Lower. And you it can, makes sense now, because like, man, you can feel this, like, oh my god, yeah. that's hard. And you can feel your pecs way more. Yeah, I feel it a, a lot more. 
Yeah. And just doing just a, a simple, like little amount, even with the bar, it was like, oh man, totally. Like totally different. Yeah. Sweet. All right, let's do the circuit. Second time. Uh, it's usually like the, the last one rep or whatever. Like my back goes down when I'm pushing. Is it, am I supposed to do that? Keep it pinned. Keep it pinned. Because once you let go, you're using all your deltoids. Like you're using your anterior delt. Yeah. But you want to pin that delt down. Okay. Keep that delt down so you can expose that pec. Let okay. that pec work all the way through. I think what you're trying to do is get everything you can yeah. in that yeah. rep. Yeah, that last so one. So you use the delt. Like I'm trying to get it out. Grind it out. I'll help okay. you out. Let it grind. Okay. Two deep breaths. All through your diaphragm. Three more deep breaths. Let's put lots of intention into your hands. Just push the ground away. Squeeze those glutes as hard as you can. Keep pulling those abs in. You got it. Focus. Focus. Exhale hard. Lift. Up. Good. <laughs> oh, those freaking push ups. Doing yoga push ups. Oh. Alright. I'll do some. For the camera. Oh. Ooh, come on. Even when you do it, it looks so fluid when you're struggling. <laughs> For the camera. <laughs> the camera adds like five more reps. <sighs> oh, I don't want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're done. <laughs> uh, so much talking going on when we train together. <laughs> <laughs>